Hey. 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 How's everybody? How come we didn't have these issues before when Janice was in on? Never had an issue. As as Blame it on me. On. I helped fix it. Give me a she break. Did. Hey. Well, you got to give credit where credit is due. It's oh, like my Janice goodness. We are here for sure. Oh, my goodness. For all you, you are able watching. To this is a little mini pinch of basil <laughs> promoting the show. Just, Just a, a little bit. Just a little bit. Just a little bit. Little pinch. That's all it is. Absolutely. It's only because I'm here they don't want to do this too long, you know? That is not true, Janice. We love you. All right. Isn't it time for you to go? Okay. Now, <laughs> yeah, see? What can I tell you? <laughs> oh, my gosh. It's, it's see all this paperwork? Here. That's why I have to go. All of that paperwork? You all really that paperwork. Want to... Here, take a look at all my paperwork. Okay, oh, there's nice. all my paperwork. Oh, yeah. no. <laughs> it's Ooh. all my paperwork. I don't want to hear about, oh, yeah, a folder. Woo! You got a folder. No, it's actually a book. It's actually uh, a part of a book. You know? Well, you know what? I actually got uh, I actually got the book from Mr. Werner, who was with us last oh, good. week. Good. So I'm going to read his book, and uh, we got uh, Maria Jacobs uh, actually wound up sending me big kudos to all of us. So uh, thank you for mentioning her name because she was on their. Um, she, I guess they're you know they're buddies and everything. So oh, uh, it was neat. really really cool. Yeah, absolutely. And uh, actually, you know, we're talking about a, a guest that's coming on. Um, uh, you know, uh, next week. Very excited. Bob Golick, uh, superstar nose tackle who played at Notre Dame, who wound up playing for the Oakland Raiders and, of course, the Cleveland Browns. We're very excited to have him next week. So for all my Cleveland peeps out there, uh, it, it, we're going to have him. And I'm really excited about that. And uh, you know That's what? Really there's good. Yeah, there's a cap. I know Nick Adams. And right there, Nick Adams. Um, I forgot about him. Uh, he's a guy who's been on the fan radio. He's done a lot of great stuff. Uh, in sports and whatnot and covering different things. We're going to have to have him on as a guest as well. So I'm very, very excited. But tonight, hey, really a lot of fun. And Janice, I know you're excited about this because you am. told me you told me he was one of your favorite field goal kickers. Absolutely. <laughs> yeah. Uh, and, you know, I'm excited to, to basically <laughs> but get him. I know you are, Janice. I know you are. <laughs> Pete Stojanovic, Janice has always had a crush on him. Back hey, in, what can I tell you? Back in hey, who, all the way. Who didn't have a crush on him? Though? I mean, come on. <laughs> I, 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 I didn't. I have a bone. Well, not a bone to pick with him. It's basically with Leon Lett's dumb ass from yeah. the Super Bowl in the snow. Oh, wow. When Leon Lett fumbled the the, uh, the block field goal in the snow. Yeah. Oh, I remember God. that. Can't wait to talk to him about that moment. Oh, like, man, it's going to be a lot of fun. A uh, let me tell you, listen, uh, Pete Stianovich, of course, all-time great kicker uh, from uh, Indiana University, also played for the Miami Dolphins and the Kansas City Chiefs. He's going to share a lot of stories. Uh, 8 o'clock tonight, but he'll be on at 8.15 all the way through 9. And, Janice, we got things we got to talk about. Oh, my God, let me tell you something. Um, to be honest with you, uh, last night, uh, the president's speech – which wasn't, you know, that bad. He was all right. It was a little, you know, come and go. And But the thing is, he gave a lot of credit to the people of Ukraine. And thank God the people of Ukraine. If any of you are watching right now, we are with you. We really are. We truly are. Uh, I don't know, uh, Janice, what you're thinking about this. Uh, the people there have just been outstandingly brave. And uh, for Paul Bond and, and uh, Avram Antonakos, who's actually watching right now, I got a chance to see him. And his lovely wife uh, this past weekend um, in in, uh, in Florida at Palm Harbor, and I want to thank all the people over at the comedy club over at Snappers, and it was just great shows. I, I really appreciate it. And of course, uh, we had uh, His Eminence Nikita, who is from the United Kingdom, who was there. He is the Archbishop of England and the, the UK, and um, just a lot of fun, man. I had a, and Congressman Gus Bilirakis, our good friend, was there too, Janice. Oh, that's very nice. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. So, you no, know, really I do fun. want to comment on your comment. And I want to say that just like the people of Canada, the people of Ukraine have to be protected. Their, their country should take care of them. That's their job. <laughs> and so, yeah, of course, you're going to be with the people of Ukraine. Yeah, absolutely. I mean, you know, what they're going through and the hell they're going through, um, you know, it, it just, crazy to be honest with you um uh, you know just a lot of nuts but hey 
tonight, though, we're going to have a lot of fun. Um, and as a matter of fact, Jr., you and I are going to have some fun with with Pete. And of course, oh, you know, sure. because when Pete used to, I mean, I, I've seen Janice's room when she was a teenager. She used to have posters of Pete from Tiger Beat uh, magazine when she. <laughs> she <laughs> You are a crazy man. Her and uh, what was it, Leif Erikson? And, uh, <laughs> and uh, let me see, David, what was that? What was that for the Partridge? Uh, all the Partridge. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, uh, shit. I come I on a pinch of basil for what reason to be abused? <laughs> Is this why I'm here? Wow. You guys. I don't know. I'm just, we I, do it. I didn't say anything, did <laughs> You were going. Are you kidding me? You were telling. Make sure you could talk about Dennis and Tiger Beat Magazine. Oh <laughs> yeah, was that was me. Sure, it was. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So who was? I mean, was it the Monkees? What what band did you listen to when you were a kid, Janice? That's so funny. What yes, the Monkees was one of them. There you go. Not. There you go. I heard. Everybody I heard. heard yeah, they were popular back Sunny then. Sunny and Cher, yeah. you know, come on. I, I got well. you, babe. Uh, you know, uh, I'll tell you what, I heard the that Beatles. you. Know, come the on. Beatles were good. I mean, they were fine. But listen, I heard that you and Mickey Dolans actually dated oh. for a while. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, me and Mickey. That's it. Well, you know, I did live right down the street from Hollywood. So there yeah, you there go. There you go. There yeah. you go. So who's yeah. left from the monkeys now? Is is uh, I don't I don't know if any. I don't know if Mickey I think Mickey maybe. Dolans is still. I think is Mickey still Dolans. Alive? Yeah. yeah, I think I think Mickey Dolans is still alive. Yeah, I tell you yeah. what. Uh, that was cool. Well, we'll talk about all the great bands that Janice used to listen to oh, back yes. in the day. Back in the Man. day. With all Got my posters you. on the wall. From Actually, Tiger I did, I did get the 45s. My dad worked, had a bar. Uh -huh. And so from the, because we had jukeboxes then, right. he'd bring home the 45s from the bar. And I wish I would have saved them now. Oh, wow. Someone yeah. posted something yeah. that was pretty cool um, that, that used to make cool. me laugh. You know, in the middle of the 45s, they had those spacers, right? right? the little spacer, yeah. This little spacers. It says, if you remember this, you're old. And I'm like, oh, my God. Me? <laughs> See, me? Like, <laughs> and not JR. <laughs> no, JR. It's okay, no, JR. You're lucky. <laughs> well, I have, well, I don't, well, you both already have glasses, or I don't know if they're both for just for reading or whatever, but I, I just picked up my new glasses this morning. And you look hot. You know, look. You know oh, yeah. if, <laughs> No, you do. If we were oh my. No, no, trust me. No, I didn't I, need your confirmation. I knew I knew I knew I looked good. Believe that. Let, let me just say one thing. If we were in prison, who knows? Oh, you yeah. know what I'm saying? Here we go again. <laughs> no, On that know. lovely <laughs> note, we know. I gotta go. <laughs> Janice, we'll see you tonight. I'm Janice. Sorry, guys. I wish I could stay longer. Okay, oh, hey, she's yeah. going to go ahead and go sign into Tiger Beat Magazine again. That's what she's going to do. <laughs> but, <laughs> she's going to yeah, kill me. She, she, oh, you're going to get it for that, for sure. But, yeah, so, Pete, we got to ask him because, you know, he was the stand-in. He was the uh, he was the stand-in for Jim, uh, Jim Carrey and Ace Ventura. Oh, absolutely. He was actually the place picker that was actually out. doing it. Laces yeah, out. Laces out. Laces out. You know. About that stuff oh, sure. I, I'm sure he's got a lot of great stories oh, about there. Oh, man. So, uh, yeah, but uh, definitely we, we got uh, – it was kind of funny. Paul Bond, he goes, you know, was it Mike? It's not. It's it's Bob. Um, you know, Bob is just a, a great uh, a, a great uh, cat to, to listen to and great stories. I can't wait to have him on because I saw him play – and of course, he actually wound up. Uh, a lot of people don't know he was perhaps one of the best. He actually won the national title in wrestling. Uh, he was a wrestler at Notre Dame as well. And I wound up. It's kind of funny. There's only two people that I ever shook hands with that intimidated the really three. Marv Hubbard. Remember Marv Hubbard? He used to play for the Oakland Raiders back in the not day. Familiar. He was, not, he, not, he, he was a running back. He was a running back during the uh, 70s, and he was at a football yeah. camp, and it was tail end of his career. Uh, Alan Page, remember Alan Page from the Purple People Eaters? Um, yeah. Alan Page, number look, Alan Page, <laughs> up, number 88, defensive tackle, yeah. never believed in weightlifting, and this guy was huge. And I mm. shook his hand, Marv Hubbard's hand, and Bob Golick's hand. And I have a big hand, and yeah. their hands just like surrounded my hand when I was yeah, like, 
Yeah, it was like I was it was like I was shaking hands with a with a first baseman's glove. That's what I felt exactly. like. I was saying, yeah, how you doing? Nice to meet you. I'm just I'm just gonna go in my corner now and just walk away. Okay. Right, right. I'm gonna be in my dress over there. <laughs> okay. So um, yeah, it was a lot of fun, but um, a lot of a lot of great people, a lot of great athletes gonna be coming on the show. We're very, very excited. Hey folks, listen, tonight, eight o'clock, uh, our guest. Pete Stajanovic from <laughs> Mr. Lace is out himself. Uh, yeah. yeah, baby. Yeah, yeah baby. baby. <laughs> and uh, we're excited uh, to have him on. Um, and uh, just a, a really cool cat, uh, to be honest. We have known him for a bunch of years uh, when he used to own a place called Kickers in Livonia, Michigan. So it's going to be great having all the Michigan peeps out there. But uh, my brother... From yes, another sir. mother, I yes, will see you tonight and uh, looking Definitely. forward to it. And for all of you watching right now, thank you all so much. We'll see you tonight, 8 p.m. Eastern time. You're watching a pinch, a tiny pinch of a, a pinch bit. of basil. Just, 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 just this much. That's not just that much. <laughs> I'll see you later. <laughs>